Welcome back everyone, Criminal Archer here. Time for some more Project Zomboid. So we found a big hiking bag at the end of the last episode, which was amazing. Because um, we were having some serious weight issues, which we're not having anymore. We are have probably, however, have some serious zombie issues. Yep. Um, so we are going to try and deal with that as well as we can. Uh, hopefully we don't die. We are going to take some food straight off the shelves and eat it, because it's going bad. And our very, very hungry um, young lady, who is our main character here, is problematic. I'm going to take those pickles, pickles don't actually go bad. Somebody bro broke the uh, back door down. That was very inconsiderate. Where does this door go? Out into the main lobby area. We got one there. We got a group outside. A couple inside. Let's pull these guys back this direction. Not sure where that lady came from. Alright, come on. Die, please, before this, your friend gets here. Nope. Alright. There we go. Alright, got him. Stay down. There we go. Another baseball bat. Man, there's there's a surprisingly large amount of weapons in this grocery store. Don't confuse that with, with uh, any kind of complaining. Just sort of surprised. More stuff. We can't take all this. I'll take the pickles, though. I know she's a chef, and so she can actually do stuff with a lot of this, but I just don't have the room for it. Cupcakes, cupcakes. Sounds like it's storming out. Take all the non-perishables I can, because, you know, those are great. I love non-perishables. And we'll just eat some of this while we're here. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Alright, let's go back over here. Orange soda, salt. Is this full? Yeah, it's basically full. Crap. Can't take that. Alright. Let's start filling up uh, just my regular main inventory until we get close. Actually, what we should do is go over here where there was um, some shotgun related paraphernalia. Probably be a better use of our abilities. Sandbag. And by shotgun related paraphernalia, I essentially mean a shotgun, which is right here. It's kind of paraphernalia, right? Would that technically follow? I guess that wouldn't technically follow, would it? Shells. I can find enough shells I can put them. I'm going to take that jar, just on the off chance we ever actually managed to do canning. It's something they added ages ago to this game. And I have never been able to do it because I've never found all the pieces for it. Oh, there's some more shells. Put them in a box in a minute. That should work out okay. Got a surprisingly large number of shells, actually. Who knew? Grocery store. Good place to find guns and ammo. I could make disparaging remarks about it being uh, Kentucky, but I still don't think. I've actually lived in the Deep South. Not currently, but I did at one point in Mississippi. And you couldn't buy guns and ammo at the grocery store, I gotta say. Put these in boxes. Alright, can we put all three of those away? We can, and we got a little bit more play there. Let's see if we can put both of these away. Twenty-seven point nine. That'll be it. Maybe put a lollipop in there. No. All right. Fine. I didn't want to put a lollipop in there, anyways. All right. Let's go outside. Uh, it's still raining. Crap. Let's 
Wait, didn't I take outdoorsman? Strong, organized, outdoorsman. Yep. Well, that means we don't really have to worry about getting all wet. So, there you go. I'm not going to worry about it. We should probably make a move to the suburbs. Where there are less zombies everywhere. <laughs> but, we will see what we can do here. We do need to find a safe place to live. That's kind of job one at this point, now that we've got basically all of the food and such situation taken care of. Finding a place to live per semi-permanently, if not totally permanently, is kind of job one. We were starting to clear over here before. But this seems probably still a little too close to make it work. But we'll see what we can pull off here. I have enough bats now that I feel like I could probably put nails in one of them um, for that bonus. I hold off when I have a f only a few bats. I hold off because the, there's no way through the trees right there. Um, because it lowers, it significantly lowers the durability of your bat when you put nails in it, so it doesn't last as long. Uh, but if you wait until your bat breaks, you can use the nails to repair it into a functional nail bat. So that's what I usually do. But now that I have like four bats, five bats, something like that, I don't feel that badly using it. Using one of them as a nailed bat. Ah, there's too many of them. Gotta get out of here. Well, maybe not. You stay down. No, stay down. I wasn't done. There we go. Oh, that wasn't so bad. Nobody has anything useful. Of course, the second option, instead of trying to actually build a or find a, a house that is acceptable to stay in is to go to like the lakeshore and set up a camp but that's going to require us to be able to build a tent and all that stuff which we are not currently capable of I don't think uh, stay away from me I stop looking away from the screen Alright, so nobody this direction. Alright, we're gonna take this little party, back it up, back it on up, this direction, and smack. Alright, let's just jog around over here. I need a second or two to at least get a couple hits on the people that are on the ground. This is going to take forever. Alright, at least one of them just died. Come on. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Now we can do the stomp and, stomp and push. That's what we like to see. Nice little pile of dead zombies. Right, let's see if we can get into this house. Hopefully an alarm doesn't go off. Should probably actually close that window behind me. Bathroom zombies? Oh, that's bedroom. Bedroom zombies? Belt and underwear. Bathroom zombies? Nope. What's in here? Anything? 
This is a mostly empty place. Interesting. I would like to, s to stay here if I can, but I don't expect to be able to. Let's start cleaning up a little bit. That was a bad swing. Stay down. Alright, that's one down. Push. Alright, how's your friend? Need of a hit, too. No, oh, stay down. And there we go. Alright. Get him, get him. Right in the crotch. Another baseball bat, huh? I'm gonna pull that out. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Where's the other one? I'll throw that baseball bat on the ground so I know it's there. I can't hold it right now. Oh, this is gonna be too many zombies. If we can't break him up a little bit, this is gonna be a bit too many. Oh, the helicopter's here. Actually, that's the small plane. The small plane is usually a harbinger of the helicopter. Yep, here comes the helicopter. Take me with you! Don't leave me to the zombies! She's getting very hungry and tired. Now let's back up. Alright, somebody just died. Excellent. Well, that was a short trip by the helicopter, actually. That's usually stay here longer. Ah! Ah! Run, run, run! Oh, that was close. Snuck up on. Bye. Oh, here comes the helicopter again. Knew it was too much to ask for that to be a one-off. Alright, let's back up here. Come on, I need some of you to die. Killed all of one of them so far. Got some more joining the party. Alright, we gotta bug out. Too many. With more joining the joining the uh, crew, I can't risk it. Let's see, bag of chips while we're walking. Yeah, 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 leave me alone. It's getting late too. Let's see if we can lose some of them through the trees here. God, I hate that stupid helicopter, airplane, whatever you want to call it. Alright, let's go see if we can get into this house. Got this guy coming with us, but looks pretty clean otherwise. Been in here before too. Come here. Get it. Alright, anybody in here? Nobody in here, okay. Close this. Close this. Do we have anything to block the windows off with? I don't think we have any sheets, do we? We do not. Crap. Alright, we're gonna have to risk it. I almost broke that window. That would have been terrible. <laughs> okay. Shotgun. She's tired. She needs a break. What do we do now? We have a hammer and nails. I'd like to do that if I can. We don't have a hammer. We left it. I bet we left it at Twiggy's actually. All right. Here's the plan. We're gonna sleep here tonight. We'll read our book for a little while. Until a little bit later. And then we'll. Um, Sleep here tonight, and then I'm going to try to get back to Twiggy's. See how overrun it is. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. There we go. Did I leave any food here? Frying pan, fork. Nope, I didn't leave any food here. Alright. 
Anything perishable in my bags? Doesn't look like it. Stupid ba stupid thing's still here. Go away, helicopter. Alright, we're gonna try to get back to Twiggy's by not going through the normal channels. Gonna go across the fields here. Slightly more direct route, should have less zombies in it. I think this will work. Suppose I should start thinking about pulling off a uh, fire zombie situation. Alright, where are you? I think I might be too far north. Don't want to miss it. <laughs> that would be bad. Oh, there it is. Alright, let's come around the backside here. I think this is Twiggy's anyways. Oh, it's the... It's the gun store that we can't get into without a sledgehammer. Surprisingly few zombies out front here. So you can get this orange soda if we want it. You can break in here, but there's a... This gate here is between you and actually getting into the store. Which makes it not as useful. Let's go back here. I think, I feel like I had a hammer and nail that I left here, didn't I? Maybe I'm remembering it incorrectly. Wow, it's really empty out here. I guess we'll find out. Did I leave hammer and nail here? Not leave it in here. Paper clip, thread. Maybe I didn't leave it here. Thought I did. But I feel like I would make it more obvious if I did. Nope, I guess I didn't. Guess not. Okay. What's in this trash can over here? Probably useless things. One battery. And she needs a break. Alright, let's uh. I don't want to do that, I want to rest. Oh, I really never understood why... Oh, because it just disappeared. That was weird. There's no way that that should have disappeared just now. Okay, everybody's on the move. Hey, and we got some blunt accuracy. Blunt maintenance is probably... Eh, I'll do accuracy. Maintenance is probably the, the better choice, but whatever. Who cares, right? <laughs> Alright, let's lurk over this direction. I don't know if there's anything over on this side. Let's we'll run down this way a little bit and check it out. Take care of this guy, I guess, since he's here and we're here. I should look at the map. Between, ep between this episode and next, I'll just spend a little time looking at the map. It's been a long time since I've been in West Point, and even longer since I've been on this side of West Point. So I don't really remember exactly where things are. I feel like the town pretty much stopped. Well, maybe not. I'll say I thought the town pretty much stopped at the edge there, but... Unless this is just the road that will eventually take you to the mall. Which it could very well be. Looks like it is, in fact. Yep, there's the railroad tracks, yeah. Alright. Something here, though. Oh, that's the construction yard? I think. Check it out. Yeah, construction yard. That's okay. We'll go into the construction yard, see if there's anything there. Construction yard wouldn't be a terrible place to set up shop. It's got relatively limited no areas of access. So it should keep the number of zombies that end up in our face down. It doesn't really have much in the way of places to stay. Oh, that fence is way bigger than I thought it was. I thought it was more like this on the other side. This might not be as good a choice as I thought. But let's check it out. 
Hopefully these are real dead bodies and not lurkers or crawlers. Real dead body. There we go. Nobody in here, huh? Fill our water bottle. Alright. Well, this is as good a place as any to stop for today. I hope you're enjoying it. If you are, consider leaving me a like. Helps me out a great deal. And I'll see you guys back here later for more Project Zomboid. Thanks so much.